welcome back to the Peak District. When was it? Last September, me and Johnny did a video of uh, something called the Barbrook Reservoir, an abandoned reservoir and dam in the Peak District, high above uh, Sheffield and Chesterfield. And that's what's just in front. If you're still wet at the moment because of the position of the sun, when you see the breach in the dam, you just make it out there. That's the old dam wall, and that's where the dam was basically destroyed. Um, to release the water when they they finished with it. But anyway, I'll leave a link to that video. We're going downstream today from the Barbrook Reservoir, and we're gonna be walking from here down to what's called the Little Barbrook Reservoir, uh, which is about a mile and a half. Uh, in that direction, there's a couple of uh, interesting things to show you on the way. So, where do we start, John? So this, what you can see here, this, this is the Bar Brook. Indeed. The, the, the stream. Which originally, I guess, would have been a natural watercourse, but you can see yeah. it's actually man-made channel to this point. Wait, as we saw, and now when it comes through the middle of that, that breach. It does indeed. It's a bit of the dam, doesn't it? But it, yeah, we, we found the spillways down the side of the dams, didn't we, there, where that watercourse would have gone when yeah, the dam was. Yeah, just coming down there. Yeah, some great, yeah, great history down there. So we're following that down here, underneath this little track, uh, underneath this bridge. It's like a bit of a railway bridge, John, isn't it? It is. It's a retro style. <laughs> it's cool. Steel girder. Yeah. We had a pound for everyone we've seen a bit like that. <laughs> but you can see, yeah, it comes to this point here, I guess the, the stone wall, and then after that it's kind of much freer and uh, it weaves its way down the valley, basically. But there were some water treatment yeah, so, works here. So basically, just up this way, there was a water treatment works plant, which I think was the earliest installation, and that's where that sort of farm is now, and there's not anything left. But at some point, we believe that they built an extension to it, um, which is in concrete, and it's actually the remains of it are just down here. Just behind just us here. Just down there. So we're going to check of those in a bit. But li limited information as ever on, <laughs> on this site, on the internet. So here's the, here's the two concrete, what do you call these? Tubs, do they? Yeah. <laughs> Basins. Like you see them, don't you? Like water treatment. Yeah, yeah, they're quite attack places. It's too small. They're not reservoirs. Um, yeah, reinforced concrete, you can see. Great example of what reinforced concrete is, look. It's such, uh, that is so degraded, isn't it? Yeah, it's like, where's it all gone? It's just like dripped away almost. It's not stood the test of time. Don't smell too pleasant either. I can't smell it actually, that's one of the things. I well, literally can't. This caught smell my it. eye from from the path. I mean it's on wheels, isn't it? I'd, maybe that's a pump the farmers used or, or something like that to get water. Yeah, I didn't think it's not irrigation. Well, it's always interesting to see bits of old machinery like this up close. You can see the steps down there. Look, I know, you like, down into even the... when it was in use, well, would you like to clean it out or something? Yeah, possibly for ma maintenance. Yeah, there's some at the other, the other tank as well. There's a section of old pipe exposed there. Now, there is, you do, some of the paths around here, you are walking on a, um, like an old, on top of an old pipeway. Um, now, there is, we've been doing the research for this, we do know there is a pipe that runs from the, the big Barbrook Reservoir all the way out to Ramsley Reservoir. So we're heading down the valley. The Barbrook's on the left-hand side, just there. And you can see the little Barbrook Reservoir uh, just coming into view. As you can see that body of water just in front. What a lovely evening for a walk. Got low sun in the sky over there. It's a bit of a fresh evening. Bit of a breeze in the air. It's another classic. We're going to get to the golden hour very soon, like we were at uh, yeah. Barbrook last year. Beautiful sunset and great yeah. light for filming. Nice colours. Not great for the uh, for the vision though. Mm, yeah. <laughs> so we're about to come over uh, the top of a. I've got a pack horse bridge. I don't know, isn't it? Is it really that old? Was I don't know if what this. I'm not aware that well, this like, is an, an old road or anything. I assume this is partly, you know, maybe used for maintenance of, between the two reservoirs. You know, yeah. like bring a Land Rover down here or something. 
I mean, there must have been a reason for it to have these these old bridges going across the brook. Yeah, this is a you know it's a substantial structure. This one. It is, isn't it? So there's the Bar Brook just burbling its way. Oh wow! Uh, down the valley, and here's this little just scramble down the banking. Watching my foot in. It's not the most even. Oh, I like that. It's lovely. Oh, yeah. It is a lovely spot, isn't it? It is beautiful. Yeah, it's coming down. This the, it's like it almost, almost mirage-like. <laughs> yeah. When you come down there and see that pond, I can imagine on a on a warm day how tempting that would be. Um, Come on, have a look at another little, another little bridge. The bridge to nowhere, as you described it as. Yes. It's right <laughs> on the other side where there's, we've got the sun working with us. Only a tiny little bridge. Something. Manhole. <laughs> it's freak. Manhole cover. Is it? Is it like an ancient manhole cover? Yeah. Those uh, concrete slabs and uh, similar things are all the way down from the road when you're walking down here. We assumed it was uh, like a pipe, pipeline that's uh, been laid from this reservoir down the valley. Not sure. So this isn't, it's a disused reservoir. It is disused, but it's basically like, it's full, so I guess it's got no purpose it's for no, supplying water. And it's not being breached. It's not like being breached, no. The other ones that we've looked at round here. Which is actually really nice because it is full and it looks pretty, whereas like the other ones, it's like a bit of a sorry state. You've just got a little, yeah. little pool of water and it, it's glory days, it would have been full. But it's also a wild swimming mecca. Mecca, basically. <laughs> so, yeah, when yeah. we first came here, there's four people. <laughs> I think they were redressing. Redressing. Not undressing, but we were like, right, let's let's walk on. Yeah, it looks like uh, we've got the place to ourselves now, doesn't it? Stay late enough, and you will. What time is it? It's ten past ten past eight. So right at the end of the usable part of the day. Anyway, you don't want to be looking at us. Just look at that. I mean, just look at that with the sun. Isn't that a beautiful shot? The Reverend Kate Botley has been here. Who? So, uh, the famous reverend from the radio and TV. You see it's man-made, can't you look? Yeah, and this is, you yeah. know, it's like a micro dam. And it's very reminiscent of the same kind of armouring, as they call it, that we saw at Ramsley. Ramsley, yeah. And you'll see that concrete structure in there as well. It's so still, isn't it, that? I, I, yeah. I have to say, John, I don't find that appealing. No, not at all, because it's so grimy. It just looks so dark. Yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, you do, do get I kitted know? up with your, like, sort of swimming shoes and shit, but, sorry, stuff. <laughs> but it doesn't appeal to me. <laughs> so this is the dam, this is the dam wall then? Yeah. Ah. That's not a lovely spot. This is an absolute, so tucked away, it's just, you wouldn't know, I mean, you wouldn't know it's here unless you knew it was here. And here's the cascade. Um, it was open to see. Uh, difficult to get a good shot because of this tree. Let's have a look. You can get down there, you can get down there a bit. You can really see <laughs> why you don't want to go while swimming in that water. Oh, wow, yeah. <laughs> it's not good, is it's it? It's brown, isn't it? Uh, that's a... Yeah, it's a nice shot of the cascade there, isn't it, down... down the weir. So the question I've got is, was that original feature or has that been added in when they decommissioned? Oh, right. I that's... assume it's original because it's so yeah. beautiful. It's not... It is, it's old, isn't it? It's old bricks. It's the same... Yeah, that's a good question now, yeah. Because it, I was wondering that. Something didn't quite sit right with me when we were still up on the damn wall. Now, 
it's quite, it looks quite empty. The yeah. dam looks like it's nowhere near its potential fill. Um, yeah, it's never going to get any fuller because it's overflowing. So it's a really good point. Yeah. Maybe they had a sluice at the top because there is like a pipe down there. It's maybe it's an overflow or something, I don't know. But it is lovely. It's just, I think this is the, the, the micro, the micro reservoir, micro <laughs> dam. Makes it so, so quaint. <laughs> well, it's not Miss Sold, it is Little Barbara Reservoir, so. Yeah, it is. Different, something different. All three uh, reservoirs and dams and features have been completely different, yeah, interested yeah. in their own way. Yeah, as, yeah. As, I have to say, bigger's not always best, but I think the sheer scale of, of the, the dam, old dam wall at Barbara yeah, it takes is still a away. the most impressive. Yeah. Little, little Barbrook Reservoir behind now. Um, couldn't have timed that better, to be honest, John. Um, Perfect, isn't it? So as we were wrapping up, I was just getting a few drone shots, and um, <laughs> yeah, some more swimmers turned up, <laughs> um, catching the last, some of the last rays before the sun. The sun disappears. It's not far off. It's not far off going. Just behind that cloud now, but yeah, it's certainly getting a bit darker, isn't it now? Lovely, lovely little spot this. Yeah, it's beautiful yeah. spot to come and explore. So it's not far from the main road, so you can just come down and it's about... But it's far enough from the main road yeah, to where be... it feels secluded yeah, and yeah, a little you, bit... Yeah, you, it's a busy road and you can't hear the traffic when you're you know, at the reservoir. And this little <laughs> valley, I, you know... That's beautiful, you, yeah. You wouldn't know this is here, it's so hidden. Well, that's, what, that's with the... Um, the rave, you can imagine why they're having it down here, because the sound wouldn't be carrying as far. And it's oh, the rave. Far. Yeah, when John was here uh, was it a few months yeah, ago, a few there years were, ago, wasn't it? people were just returning from, from a rave just down the, the what, say a rave, is that, does that make us sound old? Is I it think, a rave these days? I don't know, I think it's called a rave these days. Or a like party. That was a shepherd, didn't that? It was really loud recently. Yeah. It a rave. <laughs> but yeah, yeah people lugging sound gear and big speakers up. What's it, going on here? Just then? old now. Yeah. We're just old now, we don't rain. <laughs> right, the sun has now dropped behind behind the hills. Lovely evening that John. It's nice to be out. It's nice to be out in the evening. Oh, it's brilliant yeah. to relax. I know I said it earlier, but it's nice to make the most of these uh, the lighter nights. It's coming up to uh, the longest day, isn't it? So Yeah, 14 days. In a couple of weeks, it'll soon start to get Yeah, darker. start to recede again, no! And then it'll be Christmas, <laughs> and then we'll be stomping round in muddy issues railways again. But, no, no. So cheers, cheers for yeah. coming today. Two no videos worries. filmed after taste, not bad. Um, hope you've enjoyed that. No doubt there'll be a few more reservoirs slash things to look around uh, in this area in the future. Um, but, as always, cheers for watching. Thanks to all channel members, anyone who buys me a coffee, Sends me a super thanks. Um, really is appreciated. Um, so, ta-ra, we'll see you on the next one. Take care.